Ben, Leroy, uh, great victory and a great way to bounce back after last week. Yeah, it was a very good victory and as you said, it, the main thing tonight was about bouncing back. Last week we were disappointed, so we were losing 4-0 to the Glens. Like, we didn't reach the heights that we have all season, so to bounce back tonight and win 4-1 and get the three points is the main thing. And Ben, it was a, a real fast-paced start. Um, seemed like we kind of really went after them. Was that maybe a little bit of a consequence of last week or we, we just wanted to start very fast at home? Uh, I think that's our game plan every week. Um, probably wasn't carried out to the best of our ability last week. Um, Ovo was a hard place to go, but especially, as you say, being at home and we train on the pitch all week, we know the, the speed of the play. So, like the Cliftonville game, we just wanted to get after them early doors and thankfully it resulted in goals for us and, and we gave ourselves a comfortable lead. Uh, and Leroy, that, that first half, you know, we, we were ruthless, but we, we also had maybe some chances outside the goals as well, the four that we did score. It was just maybe one of those nights where uh, things really went for us and we, we really turned the screw and we had the chance. Yeah, the game plan was to just do what we'd done against Cliftonville, get on top of them early and just force them into mistakes. And I thought we'd done that brilliantly and we got four good goals and we got more chances to go with that. But on another day they go in, it's five or six, but we'll take the four goals in the first half and gave us a good platform to go out in the second half. Uh, and that second half, Ben, we, uh, you know, we sort of managed the game quite well. Just maybe caught with that, that very late goal. Is that, is that something that the squad are nearly sort of disappointed by that we didn't come out with a clean sheet? Yeah, there was, especially the, defend, the defenders in the group. Like, they, wanted, they pride themselves on clean sheets and they defended well up until that point. Like, they have some good players direct and their big chicken came on lucky in the first half. But as you say, clean sheets is priority, but I think that's the first goal we've conceded now at home. But we don't want to be conceding too many more. And Leroy, on a, on a personal note, a really good night for yourself. Um, a goal and, and a hand and, and some of the others as well. Yeah, scoring a goal and getting an assist tonight, it's always a bonus. But the main thing is getting the three points. And I thought the team performance just in the first half was unbelievable from the boys, so it was. So thankfully, as I said, three points and up the road. Uh, uh, ben, he's probably uh, too modest to, to mention it, but we, we probably missed him last week when he went off at half time, forced off with, with uh, the, the shiner that he, he's still um, sporting it. Yeah, we did big time. Um, I think he gives you that presence in the middle of the park. And maybe last week, we, it's no harm to any of the other boys, it's just his game is getting in people's faces and, and chasing after people. And we probably did miss that. Um, and we got caught on the break a few times then when we tried to, to go and get something from the game. But listen, look, it's a long way to go. It was one game, and hopefully, that's just a bump in the road for us. Yeah, and, and uh, those last four games have been against the four Belfast clubs last season's top four in the league as well. We've come out with nine points from, from 12, uh, or a possible 12, and, and that's been a, a brilliant return, Leroy, hasn't it? Yeah, it's a decent return, nine out of 12. Obviously, we want perfection here, so we do, and we want 12 out of 12. But as Ben said, Doval is a hard place to go to, and we didn't perform on the night. You're going to have off days, and teams are going to have off days in this league. So hopefully that's our off day for a good while now, and we can go on a run again and score more goals and just pick up more points. Uh, and another busy month ahead. A quick turnaround to Dungannon here on uh, Tuesday night. And, uh, another equally you know, big game, another three points on, on offer as well. Yeah, exactly. You get the same from Dungannon on Tuesday night. You, you do playing against the four bigger teams. It's three points at the end of the day and we'll just be going on to the next one now. Yeah, Leroy, and uh, as we play another game at Inver, uh, it's a chance to, to, to try to do you know, all the things that we, we did uh, so well tonight, try to get on top of them and try to play well and, and take the game to them, presumably. Yeah, as you said it there, just taking the game. It doesn't matter who we're playing here at Inver Park, we like to take the game to them, and then Gann's no different, as Ben said. The top four teams are just going to go out with the same game plan and press them early and hopefully get the joy that we did tonight. Uh, and with a, a busy month ahead, is it a matter, Ben, of just trying to take it game by game, not getting too carried away, not looking too far ahead, uh, or anything like that, just, just take the, the next game as it comes up? Yeah, it, just exactly that. Like, it's still early doors. We're only about 10, 11 games in. It's, we just need to take it three points at a time now, and, and Tuesday night against Dungannon is the next one. Uh, and finally, Leroy, you know, confidence must be high uh, in terms of where we are in the league, how we've started, you know, how we've bounced back from the first set back in the league and all the rest of it. You know, we're, we're kind of meeting challenges head on as they come to us. Yeah, the task tonight was to bounce back and that's the main thing, we bounced back tonight, so we did and we done it brilliantly. I know second half we kind of took our foot off the pedal and conceded a sloppy goal in there and the boys weren't happy after it. Yeah, I thought we got beat there conceding that goal right at the end, so you did, but that's the standards the boys have set this year and we keep trying to hit them standards each and every week and hopefully we can do that. Brilliant, thank you. Cheers.